alaikum. Hello. Hi everyone. Hope everyone is well. Thank you for watching my channel and today I'm I brought a different recipe. So today I'm going to cook chicken biryani. Um, it's a Bangladeshi biryani that I've learned when I go back home. So please uh, watch it, enjoy it and try it. And you can try with meat and chicken. So keep watching and let's start cooking. So first of all, we'll start off with the chicken. As you can see, I've marinated one kilo of chicken in just plain yogurt. Nothing else, I've marinated it about an hour ago. First of all, I'll add the salt. So that's one teaspoon of salt, the turmeric. This is ginger and garlic paste. So just all of that. This is donia, so just a teaspoon of donia. Chili, according to everyone's taste, so I'll just add a little bit. This is jeera, so two spoons of jeera. And this is biryani moshla, so just two spoons of that. Coriander leaves. Not much, just a little bit. A bit of mint leaf. We'll mix this all together. And just lastly, some tomatoes. Just one tomato is chopped up in small pieces. So now we leave this to marinate while we work on the rice. So the water has boiled. I'll just reduce the gas. And now I'm going to put in the spices. So this is daltini, this is bark sticks. So put that in there. Then I've got elachi. I've got a few raisins. And I've got a few plum, dried plums. And a pinch of kalijira. And a pinch of shahi jira. We'll just for, wait for it to boil. A few bay leaves, normal olive oil, just put a tablespoon of olive oil and let all that boil. Once this is boiled, now this is one kilo of washed basmati rice, so I'll just put the rice into the water. While this boils, we'll uh, cook the chicken. So here I'm going to put in the ghee. This is one tablespoon of ghee. Once the ghee is hot, I'm going to fry some cashew nuts. Just do not much. Yes. Now you can see the colors change to golden color and it feels very crispy. So I'll just take them out. So this is just uh, red onions chopped thinly, it's two onions. I'm just going to fry these onions till they turn slightly brown. Eat that for a few minutes, just maybe two minutes. So onions are done. I'm going to add the marinade for chicken that I did earlier on. And then I'm going to add one teaspoon of miso. And then leave this to be cooked for 15 minutes. So the rice is done, it's half cooked. As you can see, you can press the rice and it feels this it's cooked, but there's slightly left inside the inner bit but we'll drain this and wait for the chicken to be cooked so I've drained the rice as you can see it's perfectly done it smells nice now we're just waiting for the chicken to be cooked so, as you can see the chicken is fully cooked and now ready to be mixed with the rice one layer of rice first of all We 
reduce the fire slightly and now we'll add all the other dressings. Almond powders, so one teaspoon of almond powder. Then we will add the Cheshire nuts that we fried earlier on, so half of this. We'll add some fried onions. Mint leaves. And then we'll add some coriander leaves. And lastly, we'll add some saffron and some yogurt that I mixed earlier. Just add that in. I'll add the remaining rice on top. And then I'll repeat what I did earlier on the first layer of rice. And let that sit for seven, eight minutes. So let's now it's ready to be served. So I'm just gonna decorate this a little bit. And then just some parsley for the green effect. So this is looking pretty. And there. There you have the biryani, chicken biryani. Hope you all enjoy it and thank you for watching.